as you know, as we all know, this all started back in 1999, 99 with Hey Min Lee's murder. Lee and Adnan were students, as Lisa said, at Woodlawn High School in Baltimore County. Her body was found in the city in Leakin Park. In 2000, a jury found Syed guilty of murder. Prosecutors relied heavily on cell phone data and the testimony of a friend of Syed's who says he helped him bury the body. Syed was sentenced to life in prison. In 2014, the podcast serial debuted and raised doubts about the case, and it was immensely popular, as you know. It explained that a former student, Asia McLean, said she was with Syed in the library at the time when police said Lee was killed. We also found out that Syed's attorney knew about this potential alibi, but did not call her to testify. That attorney was later disbarred after a series of complaints involving numerous cases. Now, between 2015 and 2019, there's a lot of back and forth in court. A judge granted Syed a new trial, and after a series of appeals, the Court of Appeals denied a new trial. So now to March of 2022, prosecutors agreed to new DNA testing because of advances in genetic profiling, which Lisa will get into later. And last month, Baltimore City State's attorney, Marilyn Mosby's office, filed a motion to vacate the conviction, saying they uncovered the potential involvement of two alternative suspects. The motion also admits the case was ruled largely on circumstantial evidence, so a lot to unpack here. And that leads us to today, when the charges against Adnan Syed were dropped and the prosecutor declared the case for him is over.